Alright, here we go. Hello, everybody. We are back, and I'm just signing in for a second to show everybody this. This is the first time I just logged into the server after taking a break, and this is what's known as a Blood Moon. And during this time, a lot more zombies and things like that spawn, but they shouldn't be able to spawn inside my base too much because also you can see everything's kind of this reddish tint. But outside my base, there's probably a large number of mods, mobs. I just wanted to show that. That's kind of hard to see out there. But yes, I actually did quite a bit of mining. Now there's actually a two zombies over here. So there must be a place that they can spawn over here. Alright, let's go ahead and... Oh yeah, Endermen can get in here. But those aren't a problem as long as I don't stare at them. Let me see... F7... Okay, where'd they spawn? That's weird. Okay, but I'm going to do some more mining here in just a few moments, but I gathered enough alamite to make a hammer and a lumber axe. I put stone... Oh, there was an enderman. So I'm actually going to go back in here. Also, when it is this night, you can't sleep during the blood moon. It's to tell you, you don't feel tired right now. Oh, it did sleep. That's weird. Normally that's not supposed to happen. There's something somewhere these guys are spawning at. And I don't know where they're spawning. Is it down here? No. But yeah, one thing I want to do, I am going to probably make everything this level here. And I'm probably going to just clear everything else off that's above this level. Because I don't really want to deal with... See, so that's kind of cool. I can actually right-click on that and get the apple off the tree. I don't really want to deal with all the peaks and valleys in this base. Also, when I want to start building things. I don't want to deal with all that. I mean, I thought maybe I could keep the villagers in here, but it's just too um, hilly in here. Like right now, now I can't get back over there. I have to go all the way around. But I will be back here shortly. Okay, we are back. It is not time. Let's go ahead and sleep really quickly. I just logged in. It's been a few days since I played, so I need to get back into the groove of things. But instead of focusing on Tinker's Construct, today I want to focus on another mod called Batania. Oop, caps lock is on. I think, it's, I, think I need the Batania Lexicon. No, less Batania, there we are. Okay, is there a difference? No. Okay, so I need uh, just a book and a... Looks like any sapling. Well, that's going to be easy to make, because I've got a bunch of those right down here. Oh, I just got one book. I think i got a bunch of... Yeah, here we are. Let's just grab a regular oak sapling. Let's see if we can get this book. All that gives you one well, is just two sheets. I think it could make th takes three to make a book, but that is actually really cool. I really like that how that opens up. Okay, so what we need to make first is a petal apothecary. There we are, next page. 
so it is slabs well, I need a mystical petal so that means I am going to have to go find some Batania flowers I think I do have some back on my base now that I think about it but it never hurts to have a few more So now we have a few of these, basically what we do is we put up here and we get two, there we are. Okay, let's go back to the base. Oh yes, I actually was going to show everybody something. I've actually did quite a bit of exploring. And I found some unusual things. Actually that should be filled in, I'm not sure why that's not. But way down here... These two things, they're like um, castles in the middle of the desert. And it's very unusual. There's like some of, some other things I saw that was kind of weird. Like there's just one, um, it's like, looked like a road that's about 20 blocks long made of wood. I found a few towers and things like that. I wanted to do some exploring. So I have a few, as you can see, there's a, I like that wave point set up. There's a village over there and a tower that way that I want to start exploring. Ooh. Oh yes, I also made this. It's a grindstone, what you can do. And it's, it's from uh, Plot Energistics. It's extremely easy to make. Oh, actually, I could just look up grindstone. Yeah, it's, um, I had some of these quartz things, and those, and the wooden gear, and some just basically some stone. And you make this here, and then you have to make a handle. I think it's a, a crank or something like that. There we are. And it's just some sticks. And ba it's kind of, it's very slow, but when you right click on it, and it turns and it makes flour. And with the flour you can actually turn that into bread instead of using three wheat to make one bread. Three wheat would make three bread. So it kind of triples your food in that because a lot of the stuff you do... Oh, this I, I used um, creative mode and made that just because uh, I was trying to get the crops to grow and I wasn't able to play for long enough to actually get them to grow. But that actually will be removed very shortly. Let's see here. Uh, all of my cobblestone. Oh yeah, it's in my backpack. Alright, let's go to my crafting table and we will make this thing. So I think it was... Uh, let's see if my memory is any good. Yes, I made it. Cool. So where do I want to do... Uh, okay, for temporary I'm just going to set it up right here. So I need water. Where's my bucket? Why do I... Oh, that... That's weird. I don't know why I have two more of those in my inventory. Those shouldn't be there. I have noticed there is a du there is some issues with duplicating in this game right now. It's a pond. There's my bucket. So I may well, actually I may want to move my thing over here close to my water source. Basically, you have to put water in it, and then you can make things from it. Okay, so now we have that. The different petals, different flowers it talks about. Oh, yeah, you use these to make a pestle and mortar to grind things up. 
Okay, pure daisy is not only the most basic. Uh, any wood. That's right. I need this to make. So I need some living wood there. To make this, I need four mystical white petals. And then I throw. That is mystical white flowers. There's two. I need two more. If I'm not mistaken, I have another one of those somewhere. I thought I did. Maybe. I'm just thinking I did. Alright, let's go ahead and quickly grab us another one. Because I thought there was another one out here. Oh, my character's getting hungry. A bunch of potatoes. Didn't I make some, like, stews or something? Maybe. There's a skeleton over trying to shoot me. Oh, that's not the elm. Is it? That's... Yeah, it's from Pam's Harvest Craft. Alright, come on. we got to have some more flowers around here. Nomadic Craft, Nomadic Craft. That's the only thing about... Oh, I'm not kidding. I'm very hungry. Okay, I know I brought food. Alright, let's go ahead and just stick... Why do I have another chunk loader? I must have, when I was in creative mode, I must have not have taken it out of my bag by accident. Alright. Some more Batania stuff. I'm going to go ahead and grab those while I can. Oh, let's... Guess it broke it. I don't know if these things grow in specific bombs or not. There we are. Mystical white flowers. Just glad I don't need a uh, shears to actually cut those things. Ooh. I need to make a sleeping bag is one thing I need to make so that when I'm outside of my base that I don't die because of mobs because you can actually use it and sleep in it but not reset your spawn point. And not being able to run is actually very annoying. I guess I already put my gravel in there by accident. Oop, I'll need that. Ah. There we are. Well, I guess I stuck everything in that bag by accident. There we are. Let me get some cobblestone out. Do that so I can actually... I've seen people do this. It does make it a little bit easier to get up here. Oh, I just... Okay, so I need to put... Uh, one, two, three, four, and I need my seeds. There we are, and that should have given me a pure daisy. Oh, it's getting dark. Let's go ahead and sleep really quickly, and then I'm going to eat. <laughs> Sleeping takes, it seems to take forever when you're actually really wanting to do something. Okay, so now I am going to put this here. Let's go back to this. And pure daisy. 
It turns stone. Okay, so I need actual stone and not. Okay, do I have any... There we are. So what this will do is if I put these around this... I mean, it still works if you turn them that way. Over time, I'm not sure how long it takes, but it will turn those into... Um, living wood. Where's my bucket? Okay, so now let's go back up here, put our water in here. And I'm not sure how long this takes. Hopefully it doesn't take a long time. But let's go ahead and... Oh, from what I understand, things like the pot and things like this from Pam's Harvest Craft, it's like you can actually, like, uh, where is it? Let me make a... This may work. You can actually, like... Oh, well, maybe not. I thought you could. Maybe it's wood, not... I don't understand, it's supposed to be in, like, you could set it on top of... Or maybe it's a crafting table. Nope. Alright. There we are. I just now saw it change. So there we are. Now this has been changed to living wood. Now, let's go ahead and go back to our lexicon. Oh, I wanted a pure altar also. So this is living rock and a mana pearl or a mana diamond. To make those, you I need. A, oh, I'm gonna need. Can't make that yet. Mm, how do I remove that? Okay, here we are. I need a mana pool which takes living rock, so I need to go get me there's some bread actually I think I may have some stone up here okay nope, that's where I was making charcoal let's go ahead and stick that up there okay so what I'm going to do is make some stone, then put that around my... Ooh. Just check in here to make sure I don't have any sitting around. don't believe I do. I think everything I have is pretty much cobblestone where I've been mining. Okay. Alright. Oh, we can't ask when I eat. Let's try to see if the bread will... Yeah, it gets pretty embarrassing. But the, what I was, the reason I was making that is because you can make toast with it. Or if you can actually use, you can make like foot long sandwiches, like just different things with the different ingredients, like chicken sandwiches, and then fish, PB&J, which I love PB&J. It's a nourishing meal, okay trying to find things that would be easier to make because like this right here the hot dog I mean it's just it's oh pork and a pot and I was like that would be easy to make than some of these other things because like the leeks you or and the um, I think it's Brussels sprouts or something you can turn into stock and then the stock can turn into a soup that's pretty good but it's a, kind of involved and I was trying to make something a little bit easier but actually let me yeah, the way I'm bringing that up is if you hover over something and hit U it shows you the uses of it there we are and if you hover over something and hit R or click on it it will show you oh I need peanuts uh, that may take a I'm not sure how to get those alright let's see here 
let's check out my stone. Because that should be made now. Oh, we got plenty now. Because you can only make you can only turn eight at a time unless you get another flower. Which I could make another one, which I probably would, probably should. That way I could actually do wood and stone at the same time. I mean, you can you don't have to put the same thing around. Uh, the thing you could, like, you could do half of it stone, half of it wood. Okay, so you got to basically you gotta hit Q to throw the things in here. Get your seeds. Ooh, I missed my seeds. There we are. And let's go ahead and put this other one down. Put it there. Let's hit F7. All right. There we are. And what do I do with the wood? Did I put it in here? Yes, I did. Alright, so now we go ahead and surround that one with wood. This one with living stone. And then let's go ahead and open back our lexicon. lexicon. I need to... There's a mana pools, sparks. Don't need those yet. Functional flora, is that what I need? Basics, okay. Mystical flowers. Uh, right click on a petal on the ground will bury it, having it emit particles. For all I will grow a small amount. Okay. So I, I can grind the stuff up. Okay, so I change colors. Hmm. Alright. I'm trying to find. Mana pool. There's a. It's like a day bloom or something like that, so I think's what I need. Looks like they're in alphabetical order. Okay, which one are they? Cross always a problem. Okay, this right here is one I was wanting also. It should it will speed up the growth of some of your crops. But it requires some actual quite a bit of works as a fan, swords pushes at the mm, she ran close the wind, no. I guess it's in this one. Pure daisy. Okay. That's that. Mystical flowers. Okay. Okay, that's just telling you how those. Alright, let's see if it actually has it. Yeah, there it is. The day bloom. That's not what I want to make. Okay, so I can do it this way. Orange, blue, yellow, yellow. Alright, so I got a blue one. Got two orange ones. Now I need two yellow ones. Oh, see, now these are turned into living rock and living wood. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go find some of the yellow ones. And we will be right back. That's a blood thorn. Okay. Not sure where that came up for a day bloom. But I'll be right back and we will make us a, a day bloom. 